Alex Jones on Husuni. His name is Hassan. He's funded by Gulf dictators, hundreds of millions. George Soros and Google. He wears jackets that say bash fascist. Wait, is this real? What the fuck? When is this from, dude? How did you find this, dude? And has a club in his hand. He's a young Turk. They tasted the blood of 1.5 million Christian Armenians. And they'll taste man flesh again. <laughs> if they have their way. Bow, submit, turn your weapons in to the nephew of Turd Breath, Sink Turd Breath, Hassan. Oh my God. This is so cool. Oh. Oh my God. Oh, this is the best birthday gift ever, dude. Alex Jones. John Pecker. You can't make up that name. <laughs> That's his name, Hassan Picker. And if you're a radio listener, you can't see it. He's got his red stars, his Antifa flags, his communist flags, and he's got his baseball bat, and he's going to call you a fascist, even though he's funded by the Nazi collaborator George Soros, and he's going to attack your daughter like they did out in Oregon. Oh! I'm dying! This is literally every, this is, this is the dream. He's talking about how I'm going to have sex with your daughter, dude. Oh, oh, that's so cool. He even said that. He's going to, like, this is like a cameo. Okay. This is like, if you paid Alex Jones a thousand dollars to do a cameo, this is the best cameo that he could ever make. Chase women down. That, that's what he's pushing. And, and. Chase. Uninterrupted for the Young Turks members. And this is the sexy death porn. The sexy terror porn. Destroy the child. Corrupt them all. And their desperation as America's pulse comes back and as we stand up against the Chai Coms and defend the Second Amendment and rediscover God and family. Hassan Pecker of the Young Turks declares that America deserved 9-11, close quote, praises Brave soldier who took Representative Crenshaw's eye. Isn't that just darling? Oh, when you go to a Young Turds event, they always go where there's a big crowd because they don't have any viewers, but it's the Google set. It'll be the Google event. So let's hear from Mr. Picker. This is so insane. Oh, hit pause. America hit deserves. pause. Back it up. I forgot. He's real jealous that Joe Rogan, who, by the way, is a super libertarian right winger. He just knows how to, you know, survive in L.A., I guess. Really smart guy. That's why I get mad at Joe because he's as smart as I am or smarter. He knows all this stuff, obsessed with it. He knows more than I do in some cases. And he plays dumb, and I've told him to his face. But anyways, he has the congressman on, and Pecker is mad that he has this tiny audience, so he thinks, well, I'll attack him and say something really scandalous. Wait. Oh, that's so sad, dude. That's so sad in comparison to what my audience looks like now in comparison to Alex Jones's audience. Oh, no. Oh, Alex, I wish what could have been. And, and then all the meth heads and, and child molesters that watch my show, literally, uh, they'll think I'm powerful. Oh, you're such a big man, Hassan. You guys are all meth heads and child molesters. Alex Jones called you guys meth heads and child molesters. Oh, my God. I'm fangirling super hard right now. Oh, man. That's great. I can't believe you guys found this. I had no idea this existed. This is so good. Blabby arms. I bet he's got some big old giant bitch tits. I'm sorry, it's a family show. Just, just, just go ahead and roll this. Oh, this is awesome. America deserved 9-11, dude. F*** it. I'm saying it. We're there to partner with them. We're not there doing our own thing. We're there partnering and training. In a video and, and game. And, and enhancing their capabilities. We, we, we f totally brought it on ourselves, dude. Holy sh**. We did. We f did. In a video game, whatever, hypothetically, politically. Hit we pause again. We did, man. Back it up 10 seconds. Oh, like the Armenians deserved because they were there before the Muslims took over Constantinople and then you drove them into the mountains. But because they were Christian, they became still super wealthy because they were such good people. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, did he just say that they were good people automatically because they're Christian and they are wealthy because Christian people are good people and wealthy and Muslims are bad? Wait, what? <laughs> That's so weird. Oh, this is awesome. And so... You're named after the group that murdered them. 
and you've got a club and you say you're coming for us. Let, let, let's continue with this psychopathic worm. I wonder if he, like, is he trying to imply that I'm going to kill Armenians or something? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> also, why the fuck would his audience care? Like, honestly, they're fucking Alex Jones fans. It's so weird. Holy f He's so intellectual. Look at the way that this dip is running his mouth. I love that they're bleeping my words because this is a family show as Alex Jones simultaneously is like making an argument about how Muslims are bad automatically and Christians are good and make a lot of money because they're good Christians. It's very weird, but you got to It's oh, it's great. Justifying genocide right now. Like how, how is this? How is anything I'm saying controversial? This is a deranged mm, pervert. I apologize having to play that for everybody, but that's why I was so angry this morning. He had to pull a trigger warning on his audience, dude. He was so flustered and frustrated because he his virgin ears had to hear those disgusting words, man. Alex Jones, who combats psychic pedophile vampires. Folks, listen. You already know it's alexjones.com, infowars.com. I'm locked away in a FEMA camp right now because Obama, President Obama, the Muslim Kenyan, has locked me away, folks. But I will prevail. I am the demon of truth. I came in with an earshot of Barack Obama. He smells like sulfur, folks. It's the truth. I got the documents. But then he's like triggered by a guy who says shit like that is triggered by what? Like something I said? That's awesome. Oh, that's so good. He's a deranged pervert. He's got meth heads and pedophiles in his audience. <laughs> oh, he said, I got bitch tits. Alex Jones saying I got bitch tits is hilarious, too. Wait, hold on. Oh, this is the perfect. This is the perfect meme. I wish he ripped into me a little bit further. That's look, look at this. <laughs> look at that. I'll bet he's got bitch tits under there. I'll tell you right now. I'll I'll engage you in a spirited oil wrestling, comp oil wrestling competition. Isn't that what you like? Isn't that what Turkish people like? They like doing Armenian genocide and also oil wrestling. I'll wrestle you, brother. I'm going to tell you right now. I'll let you do the hook. Well known move in oil wrestling, which I know a lot about suspiciously, is when you put your finger in your opponent's butthole. Psychopathic pervert. I want him to do that to me. I want him to maneuver me. He's got flabby bitch tits. I know it. Unlike me, I got masculine, bodacious body. Body built like an ox. Because I take alpha male supplements, as you all know. Go to alexjones.com. You can purchase my alpha male supplements. I will eat his ass like my neighbors. This is so good. I, I can't believe I was able to trigger Alex fucking Jones, dude. That, that made it worth it. Any number of brand deals in the future that I will not be able to get as a consequence of my words on this platform at some point, I don't care. This video alone, worth it, okay? Oh, will I not be able to attend the, the speech circuit alongside the likes of Charlie Kirk and whatnot if coronavirus ever goes away? Fine. This video, worth it. Come on over here. Come on over here. No, you flipped me off. Come on, Coward. No, 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 come on. You're not an intellectual. You're a fake and a fraud.